Hey everybody, welcome on in the Home Fix. My name is Loretta. I am so glad you're here and I'm so happy to have this package in my hands. I have been waiting for this package. Oh my gosh, I ordered these donuts on October 6th. I received them on October 14th and today is the 15th on the review day and I'm getting ready to open them. So I'm going to let you know the freshness level, show you everything, smell them, taste them, and I'm gonna give you my opinion. If you are here for the first time to my channel, welcome. Those of you who have been here before, hey, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Comment below if you've had any keto-inspired donuts before and what flavor you had, what company you had, and if you'd recommend them. And then make sure you hit that like button. All right, y'all, so there is a package within a package, which is nice for double protection. Loving that. And it says, passionate, bold, honest. So... That is the tagline, the motto that they're going with. Ingredients, almond flour, allulose, monk fruit, eggs, cinnamon, nutmeg, gin ginger, clove, yeast, modified food starch, calcium, propionate, sodium bicarbonate, and water. Let's just pop this baby open. All right, I just got them open. <laughs> All right, you, yes, you have the freshness seal, but you don't need that necessarily because from the looks of the bag, they are individually wrapped, so that's cool. That's a great thing. All right, so this is what we got, y'all. Five-second rule. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six donuts, y'all. Six glorious donuts. <laughs> no, I'm not about to eat all these, just one. Time for the moment of truth. If you're on keto, let me know down in the comment section, y'all. Mmm, that smells good. Let's break open into this thing here. Mmm. All right, as I go into this, I'm going to scroll here on the side, the website, and items that they have there that you can pick up. There's a 15% coupon going on right now. By the time that you see this, that will be gone. <laughs> but they, you know, they run those stuff, stuff like that all the time. They are ready to get these things out the door. So trust and believe, keep checking back. There'll be coupons. So that's what we got. The texture, let's see, it's not spongy, which is what I was afraid of, that it'd be spongy in a bad way. Um... They are soft, but they're not overly soft. The texture is like a bread, more so to me. Like a soft bread, but not like um, a super moist cake. You know how you have a super moist cake and there's a bounce back? This doesn't have that bounce back to me. Y'all see it bouncing back? No. So it's more of a bready texture. It's not eggy though. Whew, thank goodness. Let's go in. Let me taste this. Okay, yes, like I said, more of a bready texture. It's not as moist as I was hoping, y'all. It's not as moist. Mm. The flavor is good. It does taste like pumpkin. It does taste like there's spice. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'll be right back. <laughs> that was necessary because these are not as moist as I was hoping. They are kind of dry, y'all. Did they get dried out in the shipment process? Like the time it took to get here? I don't know. Here's the other half. I'm not impressed. PBH, I'm not impressed. So if you want to impress me, try again, a re-attempt to impress me, y'all gonna have to reach out to me and send me some free donuts. Freshly baked, hand-picked. Mm -mm. I'm gonna eat, you know I don't eat. I'm gonna eat these because I paid $18. But will I do it again? No. And no and no and no mm -mm, I wouldn't would I recommend them I mean for $18 no for the 25% off 15% off 
no but y'all i hope that some of the other no these are feeling the same texture so i don't know i will be eating this the rest of this one partially <laughs> tonight and then you know when i have my coffee as i'm on my drive to work i can see this like maybe heating it up hold on hold on hold on okay i just popped this in the microwave for seven seconds seven seconds it's warm y'all know it's just <laughs> i think i was thinking that the microwave waves would impart some kind of moisture balance <laughs> it didn't happen y'all i'm disappointed i would not recommend these i'm sorry is that your final answer macros from what i saw this is nine calories two of them are fiber so that leaves you with seven net carbs for this donut. Is it worth it? If you want to stay in keto, yeah, that's still kind of high for one donut. That is not the most moist thing I've ever tasted. Look at this, y'all. I mean, it's not a hockey puck, but <laughs> it's adjacent. Okay. That's it, y'all. That's my opinion. Honesty is the best policy. So... I hope that this helped you to make your decision if you're on the fence. Let me know down in the comment section if you have tried PBH, their products. What have you liked or what has been your experience with them? And let me know too what delicious dessert you've tried from whatever company down in the comment section to help us all out and give us ideas. Hit the like button if you like what you saw today and then make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I will see you guys next week for another video of Home Fix. Bye y'all. You are now inside the video cam bonus footage. Y'all, look at this right here. I have already taken down, erased, discarded <laughs> the title from today's video. Ooh, those donuts hurt my feelings to the core. I just wanted a delicious, moist piece of baked goodness, and I did not get that today. So I will not be repurchasing. I just want to make that clear. If you decide to purchase them, purchase at your own risk. I hope they're delicious for you. Those of you who have tried PBH products, let me know down in the comment section what your experience has been and exactly, exactly what you ordered. <laughs>